This presentation is brought to you by the Lean HR and People Development Summit, a product of Lean Frontiers. Learn more about the summit by visiting leanfrontiers.com slash LHR. This one's going to be a little different. We're actually a smaller company, so uh, 50, <laughs> my marketing person put that up there. She thought I didn't have enough time to say we were 55 years old, which is pretty cool. You said that would not go. So 55-year-old, family-owned, second generation, we make HVAC equipment. Why should you listen to me? I'm the CFO, by the way, so that makes it even worse. Um, our turnover rate is 8.2%. Our voluntary turnover is 4 So we effectively don't have turnover, which can be a bad thing sometimes, but we believe that's been the result. Cambridge Unleashed is a four to six month seasonal work program for <clears throat> anyone interested in learning, leading, and launching their manufacturing career. This program allows you to live in our culture and gain hands-on manufacturing experience while being part of our family. I believe that living in this culture can change your career forever, and I want that for you. So go ahead and apply online now. So that's just a little example of uh, something we're doing now. Um, we heard earlier this morning we should, would know our why. This is our why we exist statement. We exist to glorify God by enriching the lives of everybody we touch. Um, it's not a faith statement. We respect everybody's why. Um, but when you come to work for Cambridge, um, we do expect you to enrich the life of everybody you touch, and that's each other and customers and everybody. This is just how we represent kind of our investment. Um, a tree, a healthy tree needs healthy roots, and for us the root system is people growth and organizational health, and so that's where we really invest heavily, and that for us all leads to healthy business growth, which is sustainable sales and sustainable profits. So we don't ignore, uh, ignore revenue or profits, but it's really not where we spend most of our time. Our how we behave statement, we express unconditional love and high expectations by treating one another one another with care, courage, integrity, and respect. And that basically just means we're a family and we want to be a healthy family. And we don't, we're not afraid to talk about love in that context. And we do it all the time and we hold ourselves accountable every single day to those values. Um, to love unconditionally just means love as a verb, not as an emotion. And so we love you as an employee for who you are, not what you do. But we do expect you to do what you do really, really well. And that's just how we treat one another and, and the accountability we have with one another. Those are some of our sales guys at a trade show. We do talk about putting people over profits, but never ignoring profits. Somebody we love and respect told us, this is all really fun stuff you're doing, but don't forget you have to make money. Um, and our philosophy is, this is really what we love to do, is people growth. But we can't do people growth unless we make money, unless we're constantly growing and increasing revenue and profits. For us, our lean is really just continuous improvement. If you came to Cambridge, it's not traditional Toyota production system. It's simply everybody improving everything every day. That's what lean is to us. It's just really simple, continuous improvement. And that all started really with a methodology some of you may have heard of called Two Second Lean. Paul Akers has a small company in Bellingham, Washington. We met Paul, he's crazy. And we had been doing Toyota production system, failing at it, and about three and a half years ago, we decided this was the approach that we were gonna take and that would work for us, and it was transformational for us. It's really just simplified Toyota production system. So TPS can be hard in small companies because it's complex and expensive. Um, and basically, he has three pillars. See waste, eliminate waste, and document that, and we do that through videos. Um, so basically, see it, learn, teach people to see it by teaching them the eight waste. There's actually eight. Unused employee genius is number eight. Um, get them to hate waste and then give them the power to eliminate it without asking for permission. The last part's the most important, which is document it. And so we do that through short videos. You got to see some of those. We show them every day on a morning meeting. They're 30, min 30 seconds to 60 seconds. We actually have about 7,000 of these videos in our video library that have been created in the last three and a half years. And I've got a few examples for you coming up. So uh, my lead project today, we're gonna try and standardize these whiteboards. Uh, I came up with an idea. That way they're all the same. Eventually we'll get them all on every card. Morning Cambridge, Josh Palmer over here in pre-paint. Uh, what you see here is two of our assembly carts. One, our standard size, and one recently modified. Uh, due to the changing nature of the season and employment, and the fact that our good friend Billy here is just a slightly shorter than I. It's made Which it quite Billy difficult like for him to assemble some of our right larger there, stuff. So what we did was we came up with the idea to reduce the size of one of the carts. So that way I would have one I could use and Billy would have one he could use and we could both get our work done with a nice easy flow with as little struggle as possible. Hi, this is Matt from S Final. So I used to have the P-handle that used to hang right here, but I got this from maintenance. 
So now I have a little hook right here. So it just sits right there. That's a lot easier. That's my two-second lean. Thank you. So just think of the power of 7,000 of those little small improvements, and that's really what it is. So for us, daily habits are really, really important, and a morning meeting is one of our most critical daily habits. We never miss it. We never don't do it. Um, it's an all-employee morning huddle. It lasts for 15 to 20 minutes. That's just a photograph. It's out on our floor. We're not air-conditioned, so it can be really hot out there for the office staff. Um, for us, um, one of our core, our core leadership um, characteristic that we shoot for is humility. Um, we actually hire for it, and um, we think it's the foundation of leadership. That's a picture of half of a group of 28 that we put through Dale Carnegie training earlier this year, which again was transformational for us. Um, another leadership trait for us is vulnerability, and you heard us say courage as well. So morning meeting is led by volunteers. We have about 70 volunteers out of our 140 employees. They put themselves out there. They're vulnerable. They're courageous. The single biggest scary thing for people to do is speak publicly, and that's a way for us to train people that want to be leaders to do that. We, like everybody in Lean, we trade a lot of information during that. This is a couple of our KPIs for safety and delivery. We also do quality and revenue. We disclose revenue to all of our employees every day, and we uh, disclose full P&L to our employees on a quarterly basis. So we talk all the way down to income with all 140 of our employees. And that's just some social media info and stuff that if you're interested in knowing more, happy to talk to you. This presentation is brought to you by the Lean HR and People Development Summit product of Lean Frontiers. Learn more about the summit by visiting leanfrontiers.com slash LHR.